It's been a weekend of tears and tributes at Hard Rock Stadium following last week's murders of two FBI special agents. A day after Agent Laura Schwarzenberger was remembered, today was devoted to the memory of Agent Daniel Alfin. CBS 4's Jessica Vallejo takes us there. Special Agent Daniel Alfin is 10-7. End of watch, February 2nd, 2021. You will be missed by your FBI brothers and sisters. We will take the watch from here. It was a solemn day at Hard Rock Stadium as hundreds came to pay tribute to Special Agent Daniel Alfin. Alfin and Special Agent Laura Schwarzenberger were killed in an ambush on Tuesday while executing a federal search warrant at a Sunrise home. Dan's legacy is one of passion, dedication, and principle. It's what you imagine when you think of a proud FBI agent who will do anything to catch the bad guy. The 36-year-old was a New York native and started his FBI career in Albany, New York office in 2009. He was assigned to the Miami office in 2017, investigating crimes against children for more than six years. FBI Director Christopher Wray said special agents Alfin and Schwarzenberger, who was honored on Saturday were best friends on and off the field. If Laura were here today, she would agree that she and Dan were cut from the same patriotic cloth. And he was not just a devoted FBI agent, but a man who loved his family, who loved life. No doubt those of you who worked with closely with him were familiar with his sharp intellect, his toughness, his dry wit, and most importantly, the thick layer sarcasm he liked to lather onto every statement. While today we say goodbye to Daniel's body, we will never say goodbye to his soul. Yes, to sing. Alfin is survived by his wife and his son. I'm Jessica Vallejo, CBS 4 News.